What's up guys, Nepenthes here and welcome back to another FUT Champions Rewards video. Um, today's video we're going to have Diddy Chris Lito, a uh, big fan of him and his work. He's been a very big lucky charm for me uh, while I was playing FIFA. And uh, we're also going to have the elite rewards of Skillshack, who got 28-2 and two this week. And then either later today or maybe tomorrow, uh, depending on how things go um, throughout the rest of the day, we're going to have also rewards uh, again on the channel. Um... I apologize if the video is even worse quality than before. SharePlay, for some reason, is just giving me really low quality. And I can see on the screen it's relatively low quality um, because it's just packs. Hopefully, uh, you guys will be okay with that because it's no game. You probably can't even tell, actually. It looks okay. Um, and, yeah, thank you for being here. So, this is Diddy's team. What a squad that is. David De Gea. 790,000 coins. Carl Walker, first owner. Van Dijk, 2.3 million. Uh, Varane, 1.5 million. Marcelo, under 1 million coins. Rude Hullet for 5.1 million coins. What's crazy is I sold my 93 Rude Hullet for like 5 point, what, 5, well, 6 mil on the dot, was it? It's only a million coins more for the prime Hullet. That's crazy. Or, well, we're going to get the super, super duper prime soon as well. Uh, Patrick Vieira coming in as well. Cristiano Ronaldo's regular card. Hopefully, we can make enough coins today. For uh, Diddy Chris Lito to upgrade to the 99 Ronaldo. He's got 97 Mbappe, who is an absolutely moronic good card. And then Eusebio as well and Neymar Jr. there. What a team that is. Uh, absolutely sensational squad. Of course, if you guys are enjoying the videos, you want to drop a thumbs up. That would be much appreciated. If you want to check out uh, the two guys in today's video, links will be in the description below. So for division rivals, we are going to be taking untradeable rewards. Um, 250Ks and two megas and let's hope that we can get ourselves some big players here like the the, the team of the week is is all right um Pogba Rodriguez Casemiro Thiago Silva Sterling Dzeko any like any 87 or higher rated card would be really really nice just for SBCs if that should be the case but obviously Rodriguez Pogba and Casemiro would be fantastic 62nd in the world for Diddy. Good to see him back in the top 100. Uh, four player picks, one team with the week pack, and three 100k packs. So, how lucky can we get? I want to see those big cards straight off the bat. Not too bad. I mean, I, I, I assume he's going to take Laporte. Um, I'm going to wait for the, for the message to come in. Um, I would take Laporte here, uh, I, I guess. Um, we're just waiting for the DM to come through. It's come through on my phone, but not on the, uh, not on the, um, yeah, it says Laporte. There we go. Uh, yeah, there we go. So uh, I medic Laporte, the first one. So an 86 rated, not a bad start. Frenchman from the Premier League, maybe a good omen. Can we get Paul Pogba in here? No, we can't, but we get Casemiro. That's fantastic. This is a very good card, man. Medium high, 6-1, a little slow, um, but great defense, great physical, good passing, and then, like, I don't know, man, it's, it's a weird card, isn't it? It's like, it's like really, really good in some areas and really, really bad in others. And then Casemiro is exactly who Diddy would like. That's not bad. An 89 and an 86 is pretty legit, man. I, I, can't, I can't lie. And we're also going to get, I guess, Bellarabi coming in here. This is actually an okay card as well. Really good pace. Good dribbling with high agility. A little low on stamina. Um, shooting's okay apart from finishing. And yeah, he wants Bellarabi there to get... Le I think Laporte's shown up all three times so far, hasn't he? So an 85, an 86, an 89, and a 90 EA. Come on, give us that James Rodriguez or Paul Pogba. No, we're going to have to go with Pizzi. Oh, God. Um, Laporte showed up every time. That's tough, man. That's really tough. Uh, and uh, Diddy indeed wants Pizzi. Um... There you go. I mean, that's not bad. One of the big cards, an 89 rated in there. Not sadly one of the 90s, uh, but that's not too bad at all. Could have been better, could have been worse. He's up to 1.1 million coins now as well, which is fantastic. We're going to start with the untradeable packs, the two mega packs to go first. Fingers crossed for a, an inform walkout and a big card. No walkout to start with. It is going to be a boards though. That's quite nice. Is it going to be a nice boards? Brazil? Striker, damn it. We're, oh, no, even Gabriel Jesus is not much. You, you, you kind of only want Fabinho when you see Brazil, don't you? There's not really much else you see. You want to see Dutch Van Dijk, really. Gabriel Jesus can go in. Once again, I know the quality of the video 
isn't spectacular. I do apologize for that. Uh, it, funnily enough, like it is just share play. Share play is usually really clean, but for me today, share play is not looking too great. Um, so mega pack number one didn't really give us much, just Gabriel Jesus to start with. Mega pack number two, no walkout in this one. Are we going to get boards again? Yes, we are. That's not bad, man. Boards on boards. I don't mind that at all. French. Striker, Benzema, Lacazette, not bad, an 84 rated Premier League player, always good for SBCs, not that Diddy needs SBCs, he literally just needs like the the, the new super prime icon uh, Hullet when he comes out, the better version of Eusebio when he comes out, um, the better version of Cristiano Ronaldo, and then I don't even know, like, that that's it really, uh, his team other than that is pretty complete. Um, let's send all of these guys up to the trade path for him. That Lacazette, sadly, is already um, a duplicate untradeable. So we'll send these two down. We'll send these guys up. And then we'll have to, sadly, get rid of Alex Lacazette as well. Two more untradeable packs to go. The 250Ks. Can we get a walkout from one of these, EA? Come on, give us something. Nothing in the first one. I would. I don't. I prefer walkouts from the 100K packs because they're tradable, obviously. And here we go again. Brazil again. Goalkeeper this time, and it's going to be Neto. It's not even Allison, uh, but another 84 rated in the bank. Although we did have to discard uh, Alex Lacazette there, which is a uh, pretty bad. And and Diddy's just said to me that regarding his um, red player picks, he says. I'm happy, good ratings. So as long as he's happy, I'm happy. I would have preferred to be able to get him Pogba, um, you know, Pogba, Rodriguez, or Thiago Silva. But if he's happy, I'm happy. One more 50K pack to go, guys, before we get into the big 100Ks. We still don't get a walkout here. Are you kidding me? We get boards every single time, which is nice. I would just wanted one of those walkouts. It's going to be Schmeichel, another 84. We are picking up lots of 84s. Um... We just can't get we just can't get the, the, the bigger cards. Oh god, we might be in trouble here with duplicate untradeable. Schmeichel is gonna get discarded, sadly. Lucas Lieva can go up to the trade pole. Uh Gonzalo Guedes can go up to the trade pole, as can Suarez there. Uh, but yeah, Schmeichel sadly gonna have to go. So I, I could have done the, the the glitch to get him on the trade pile. I don't know if Diddy would have uh, even cared. So three one hundred K packs, EA. It is time to get that first walkout, please. Not on this occasion. At least give us an inform. It is boards again. It's no inform on this occasion. It's Spanish. It's a striker. It's it's Morata. It's not even Costa. <sighs> he would be one to watch tomorrow. Not that, you know, I know that's not how packs work, but he would have been one to watch tomorrow. Um, but Diddy now is he's giving me some weird faces, some side faces. I don't think he's happy with what these packs are offering. Yeah, he's now he's he's gone from I'm happy, good ratings to feeling quite sick right now. Um, I think he wants something a little better. EA, an icon perhaps. No walkout again. Uh, uh, at least his boards again. It's Nabi Cater. That's tough. That's really tough. Um, if, if I, I mean, I could show you my, uh, my DMs with him. Look, you ready? Let me just make sure there's nothing on the timeline that's going to, uh, going to, going to impede the video. Laporte, Casemiro, Bellarabi, Pizzi. I'm happy. Good ratings. Fingers crossed. Sad face. Sick face. Oh my God face. It, it's gone from, from, <laughs> I'm very happy about this to, wait, hold on. What is life? Um, but there are still a few people on my timeline hitting some good things, some good items. I might have to discard some of the, the trash bag cards out of these this last 100k pack, sadly. And here we go with the final 100k pack. Can we get our first walkout? No, we can't. That is absolutely absurd. Not even a special card. Not even an inform. Fabinho. No, it's Lucas Leiva. Are you kidding me? Don't worry. Fear not. Because the ultimate team of the week, he's so upset right now. The ultimate team of the week pack is going to have um, the best ever in it. It's going to have the best ever. He's, he's saying, oh my, he's just, he, he's fuming. He's fuming. But don't worry. Don't worry, Chris. EA's got you, bro. Walk out at long last. And it is going to be Paul Pogba. It's going to be French. It's Ed and Dzeko. Wow. So we didn't get Thiago Silva, Paul Pogba, James Rodriguez, or Casemiro. 
we need we need Raheem Sterling also in here. Otherwise, because Sterling's in form is going to get upgraded as well, probably to like an 89 or a 90. That is tough. That is that is your top 100 rewards, guys. One, two, three, four, five, six, eighty ones or lower. Sharp, Dante, Sirigu. Laporte as a left back is going to be useless. Yeah, 60k. And Ed and Dzeko under 60k. That has got to be, genuinely, other than the, the decent red player picks, that has got to be one of the worst top 100 rewards I have absolutely ever seen in terms of like the whole collective of rewards. I've seen worse packs, worse like 11 informed packs, but all of the rivals rewards were terrible. All of the champs rewards were terrible. And there was like one good pick in the red rewards with Casemiro and a couple of decent ones with Bellarabi and Laporte. That is absolutely shocking. We're going to move on to the account of Skill Shack now, guys. I will be right back. Okay, guys. So that was the top 100 rewards of Dulsta. We are now on the Mighty Peds account. Uh, he got Elite 1 this week with this team. Fantastic squad again. Hopefully, again, we can get him some en en enough coins to A, get a couple of players to fill out his squad. I mean, it's going to be a bit difficult to play with just nine men every game. And B, that we can get enough coins to upgrade Mbappe, Neymar, and CR7. Um, Rude Hullet there, really nice. Much cleaner connection this time as well. So uh, share plays giving me nice, uh, nice connection. That's a nice squad. Interesting that he's using Mendy. 140 games on him. He is a quality card with four-star, four-star. He's a basic chem style on him as well, which is very, very... Uh, Interesting. I mean, it works. It's it's a it is a great card, all in all. But yeah, team of the year Varane, <clears throat> team of the year Kante, and we're perfect. That's that's exact. That's all we need right there. Team of the year Varane and team of the year Kante would be absolutely ideal. Uh, so let's go and get ourselves enough coins. Uh, the mighty ped would like tradable division rivals rewards. So uh, what is that? A rare players pack and a mega pack. Hopefully, we can get something good in these. And then uh, also the Fart Champs rewards. As I said, you know, it is um, sadly only Elite 1 this week. Ped's been in and out of the top 100 over the course of the year. You know, with, with these guys, sometimes they miss out on top 100 just because they play their games a little bit later. You know, if you get 29 wins, you can still miss out on top 100. So three red player picks. Can we see Paul Pogba, James Rodriguez? Or uh, Thiago Silva, not a good start. I met at Laporte, who seems to be popping for everyone all the time coming here. Uh, I'm going to guess that Ped wants Laporte here. He says, I could choose the Reds. Perfect. So I'll just go for the highest rated unless we get like a, a madness with, uh, you know, picking up two big cards in the same one. And we get Casemiro again. So we got Casemiro with, uh, with Didi Chris Lito before. It's a nice card, 89 rated, huge for SBCs. He does, funnily enough, well, he could potentially fit into his squad if you put him there with uh, with uh, Sergio Ramos. And then last but not least, the third and final pick. That's tough. Not even some of the 85s or 84s or whatever. We're going to have to take Sharp because he already has Laporte. That is what you get, guys, for Elite 1 in this game. Now, again, tell me why you want to play this game. Casemiro is all right, actually. Like, you know, he's a bit slow. His, his stats are a bit weird, but it, it's a good card all in all. Let us move on to the rewards. Obviously, the two Team of the Week packs, the two, well, the one Mega Pack, sorry, because it is tradable this time around. So one Mega Pack, one 50K Pack, and two 100K Packs. Can we get anything of note? No boards out of that Mega Pack. That is tough. Right wing, it's going to be Pedro, isn't it? Otherwise, it would have been Vasquez. Or, or is it... Yeah, no, it was Pedro. There we go. I got it right. Happy days. And then we can get rid of that badge and sell that on. And then a 50k pack, guys. Come on, EA. Show me that floor. Let me see the walkout symbol. Not this time again. Got boards on this occasion. No in form yet. German. Goalkeeper. Oh, it's Horn. That's even worse. Leno is okay. Bauman is decent. Not great, but... Horn is the worst because he's from the Bundesliga too. So that's quite tough right there, guys. That was the Fuck Rivals rewards. Hardly worth playing for. I actually don't think he played for them. They, you know, they just come from the points that they get from Foot Champs. And then 100k pack number one. Once again, not a walkout. I am struggling to hit any kind of good good cards here on anybody's rewards. Uh, McTerry and their 84 rated coming in. Hopefully we've got a few other 84s as well. 
What do we see here? No, we have got the new uh, the new Condog beer, however, although he's already worthless. Uh, so that's quite interesting. Um, and then a few other dead cards there that no one really cares about. Uh, Jumbo Rare Players Pack number two. We need a walkout here, EA. Come on, hit us with something. No, my God, man. It's boards again, but I, I have not hit an inform. Is that going to be Manalas? No, Socrates. I have not hit an inform out of any of the rivals or 100k packs so far although you watching this after Dulster's rewards i haven't yet opened Dulster's rewards so potentially um what i'm saying now might be wrong i might have hit some big stuff with Dulster, but we get 284s in there 384s with tellers that's not tellers isn't bad he's one of the more expensive 84s but that's not great now from these two premium team of the week packs i uh, we really need to see the walkout symbol every single time we do get a walkout it's a great start show me that french flag ea come on let's hit a tradable paul pogba german right wing so, uh not surgeon abri it's a uh, bellarabi coming in 85 rated it's okay it's okay um you know i don't think we can have much else in here there's not really many lower rated cards bef yeah i mean look at that that is, that is, that's shocking. I don't know what Bellarabi's selling for. About 70,000 coins. That's okay. It's, it's not great. It's okay. And then premium team of the week. Premium. Bear that word in mind. Premium team of the week pack. No walkout. We got one walkout from all those rewards. And this is going to be... This is going to be a, a banger, isn't it? <sighs> Pre His stats actually look okay. It, imagine if this guy gets a team of the season. It'll be pretty legit. But... Premium team of the week walkout, guys. Premium. This is what you get. This is what you get for finishing on 28, 29 wins. It's brilliant. Uh, it, you got to love EA, man. They just like they EA big fans of rewarding their players. Um, this is going to be the end of the video. Once again, if you want to check the dudes out, links are in the description below. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed it, be sure to leave a like, rate, and comment, and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. But for now, guys, I'm out. Peace.